This is a call to arms. Cast off your current self and be more. MFT 28, this is your fit test guys. This is where you get to measure where you've been to where you're gonna go. Like I said before, 28 days from now, day one starts today, who you are today, dead and gone. That person doesn't exist anymore. Who succumbs exciting? How's that gonna happen? Hard work, sweat equity, due diligence, sacrifice, you become that person that you know you can be. When you don't just talk the talks hollowly, but you back them up with action. How do we make sure our process is in accordance of our plan? We do a fit test. Knowing where we start, then to where we finish. MFT 28, fit test. Begins now. One minute on the clock, push-ups. Your form doesn't matter. What do I mean by it doesn't matter? Because you're not comparing yourself to anybody. You're not comparing yourself to me, your friends, or anybody else. You can do that if you want to get competitive. But the real measure and the real test is where you are today and where you are then. That's what matters. The growth in life. So if your form is doing these half reps or doing full reps, you keep that consistent. If you do one half ass with bad form and the other one good form, you're not measuring the same test. That's imperative guys, your form must be the same test. One minute on the clock. And you're rocking them out guys. Here we go. As many as you can do. 60 seconds, push up. Go. Eighty-seven push-ups, guys. Eighty-seven push-ups in sixty seconds. That's where you are right now, day one. You do that again on day twenty-eight, and get ready for the wow factor. Next test: half your weight bicep curls, guys. Whatever you weigh, load half the weight onto a bar. You're gonna stand here and do as many reps as you can do, curl-wise. One minute, 60 seconds. Time is on. Let's go, get it on. Bring it up. Fifty reps. Next, guys, on the fit test. We're between two dumpsters here. Why am I doing all this stuff in the dumpsters, man? Because I won't give you no excuses, man. No excuses. Well, you can't deliver this kind of test to ensure you become that person in 28 days. F***ing muddy, two dumpsters here and shit. We're gonna be doing body weight dips. One minute of dips, guys. 
All out, whatever you got, man. Record that number down. 60 seconds worth. Set a minute on the clock. Deep breath. Let it begin. Go. That's 45. Still 10 seconds left. I couldn't even complete a minute. That pissed me off? Sure, it pissed me off. Well, it pissed me off enough to ensure I give it my all in this segment of 20 days to ensure that at the end of 20 days I go for a full minute. 45 in a minute is all I could do. That's test number three, guys. Next. Body weight pull ups, chin ups, whatever you guys want. Get an elevated surface. I got two dumpsters here. I got a piece of wood. Some of you guys might have like a pull up bar in your house or your room or anything else in the gym. That's cool, man. Use that if you want. It's a little bit harder with this thing. It's not round and everything else. It's cool, don't worry about it. I'm gonna put it right here in front of these two dumpsters, man. Lock and load right there on that motherfucker. How many times are you gonna do it, man? 60 seconds. I don't know too many people that can do pull ups straight for 60 seconds. So it's maybe it's like the failure, however many you can do. But you can go for a minute, man. At the end of the minute, if you can't do any more, then you hang there for the, for the remaining 40 seconds or 20 seconds or 10 seconds. You hang there. Feel where you've been, where you can't move your body anymore. When you're that exhausted, you're not capable of moving your body. So many people can't even do one pull-up. And you hang there like some piece of meat let out to dry for 60 seconds. At the end of this, you'll be moving. You won't just be hanging. One minute begins now. Couldn't go a whole minute, man. Had to tell you before that. Got about 28, 30, I'm not quite sure. Next fit test, guys. Squat jumps. From here, up, and back down. How many can you do it in 60 seconds? That's all it is, man. The other thing about this test, though, guys, isn't just your speed, your power, but also something called coordination. If you come up here and you're all exhausted and you're your, your, your muscles aren't quite working on a limited state of oxygen, and you come up here and you trip. You're gonna wreck your nuts, man. It's gonna be a bad test for you. Lock and load, here we go.
final test, final minute, guys. Laying here on the dirt. Got my feet underneath this uh, truck tire here. I bet you can guess what we're about to do, man. Straight up sit-ups, man. When you do sit-ups, man, don't go behind your head. So when you start hitting failure, you try to find anything you can to get up. You know, you start cranking your arms like this. Put a lot of undue strain on your neck, back, everything else. What I'd do is put your hands here or right on your forehead here. All we're gonna do is go down, so our shoulder blades touch, they touch, and they go. All you have to do is cross 90 here. You know, you know, all the way up here, you're just wasting time. One minute on the clock, you're hitting your ass. And oh, by the way, this rocks the shit in my ass is under right now. Yeah, I don't care. This makes me want to move faster than that minute I got here, man. Again, life's never gonna be a smooth sail life. It's, you gotta, you gotta make lemonade out of lemons, mother. That's how you gotta go. Go. I go to sleep tonight, man. A little stronger mentally and physically than I woke up that morning. That's a good day. You can buy them for seven, that's a good week. Four more for a good month, 12 more for a good year. The thing is, with the MFC 28, you don't have a year. You got 28 days, guys. 28 days. Man, we're gonna make it all happen. Greg Flint, help me stay fit. Thanks for watching.